I am at Upcycle, a brand new store that just opened this week with our lovely friends Jen and Dave Campbell who Yay. started this store after five years of building and hoping and dreaming and here we are. So it's all about upcycling, it's all about taking something that somebody doesn't want and making something new out of it. So the entire store, including the paint on the wall, is all recycled and upcycled. Well, the paint that people take to the dump ends up being collected by this company in Niagara. They reformulate it and then they sell it in retail environments. So and we're going to be one of the retail stores for Niagara. And this is made where? In Port Roberts. Look at that, it's a local business. Very a local cool. business supporting a local oh, business. business. <laughs> Yay. We have items here from Nova Scotia to British Columbia. So it's not just about us, it's about all the local vendors as well. Look at all this stuff. And all of this is, ups oh, tell me about this stuff, Dave. So we have a great couple that are moving to Guelph to work for John Sleeman, building uh, barrels for his brewery. And after the life cycle of a barrel, and it can't be used anymore, they take it and make furniture and great home decor items from that including those coat racks and stuff on the wall. That's all made from recycled products. That musical thing they gave it all. Yeah. I really like that. They're all handmade, they're all one of one. <clears throat> oh, and I remember hearing a pretty cool story about these, but they didn't go to the dump. They came here and got turned into these. And if you look closely, even the hockey pucks are upcycled. So these are from our friends in Yarmouth, Nova Scotia, and it's a job creation um, program that they have, and they have people learning job skills, and they take recycled hockey sticks from all over and turn them into new products, and we're the only store in Ontario to have this product. We're pretty proud of it. Any hockey fans out there, this is a perfect idea. And we have cowbells. Let me grab one. No! You know you need uh, actually, can you ever have enough cowbell? No. You can never have enough cowbell. Look at that, I have enough cowbell now. You take this to the hockey game, you'll be the hit. And there's a hockey stick. You'll either be a hit or you will get, get, you will hit, get hit with the hockey stick. You might get, yes, <laughs> taken into the boards. We will have uh, the table set up for people to do paint classes. So we have maximum 12 can uh, participate at a time. $25. And uh, we'll do everything from the beginning right through to show you how we process the signs. This one started right here. If you want to take a look oh, at that. Oh, that's so bad. That's a bit of a start. Oh, turn that around for me a second, would you? I don't have oh, it's not on well, there yet. Oh, would. I thought that was. Th th these yeah. people are right sincere about upcycling, folks. So look how you hang up these pictures. Can you identify that object? Yes, it's a pop can <laughs> tab. <laughs> <laughs> Very cool. This is so 2020, isn't it? This is this is what people crave nowadays. Fantastic. Fantastic. Congratulations. They've been open for two, two days, three. three. Count them three days. This is day three. Yes. Day three. Wonderful. Come when, soon. When our Come friends soon. drop by, it's always better. So yeah. thank you for Come coming. soon when you can say and then you can later say, we knew them when. Because <laughs> that's what's going to happen. Congratulations, guys. Thank you.